Let's just take these. I might feed these two to uh, Catalonia, though. But whatever. First things first. Let's go win the war. Actually, this is a perfect time for a Siggy break. <laughs> this is beautiful. Take that from Habsburgs. <laughs> Take them apples. <laughs> Amazing. I'll see you guys in just a bit.
Well. Ah. The bots talk. <laughs> oh, is this game fun? Oh, this game is the greatest of fun. And also, slightly uh, drives you insane every once in a while, but, you know, what can you do? I think these guys totally give access to, uh, well, totally give access. Yes, they do. For some reason. Oh, I get access because they're my ally. I see how it is. Alright, so then we're going to move these guys into Navarra. Yeah, people better join a coalition now. Holy shit. We need another ally, man. Shit, Poland rivaled us. What about Sweden? Sweden freaking loves our face. Let's get ourselves an alliance with Sweden and call them into this war. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, this game is so broken sometimes. St like, absolute and utter and total. Oh, come on, man. Don't you want to give me access? I'm fighting France, you know. No, he doesn't want to give me access. I'm going to have to go uh, ship these guys over. Is that a Catalonia vassal? That is definitely a Catalonia vassal that we've been improving relations with. I wanted to integrate them before, but I couldn't because, you know, I was, uh... I suddenly got a PU over thingy my boggles. What's his face? Yeah, you can totally walk through this land. I don't know what the... Can you? No, you can't. Nah, both of them hate France, so they won't give access. So we're gonna have to ship our dudes over manually then. That kind of blows. Ugh. Take the armor tradition hit. Armor tradition's really hard to get, but uh, no, I can't use. I can't use any of that crap right now. Yeah, we have an error. Our legitimacy really doesn't matter. Let's go ahead and get that royal marriage. Now, we do have too many diplomatic relations. Let's see if we can ditch something. We can ditch the relationship with France. No longer need that. Oh, uh, I should probably explain this. I switched my uh, my cannon from the large thingy to the culfrin. The Pedrero has an extra defensive morale point, but the culfrin has defensive shock. And what cannons do is uh, they d they convert their defensive pips into uh, they give them over to whatever the frontline unit is whether it's an infantry or a cavalry now a defensive shock is really important at this stage of the game because if you look at this um, this is all really big and even though France has a lot of morale boosts I think we're better off having some more uh, shock defensive defenses shock defenses now the coolest thing about these forts is that I do believe if I'm not mistaken let me just open up the fort tab here yeah um, so this guy has forts in Girona and Roussillon so there is no way for France to enter Barcelona without first sieging these forts down so we can pretty safely uh, move our units into Barcelona or even uh, yeah or even this province down here Tarragona and they won't be able to uh, to siege that down. I mean, to attack those. So I can get my entire army in here. That's pretty nice. Downside of this is I can't unsiege whatever he's sieging up here. Unless I uh, move my entire army there as well. But I do believe my entire army can beat the shit out of the entire French army. I, I have full faith in, uh, in the quality of my troops. In the quality of my troops. There you go. Now, is there a cool advisor we can get? I would like to get... Oh, we already have a pretty good one. Castile would give me access. I... Oh, wow, he would. Okay, never mind then. We can just walk across. And we'll uh, meet up in Bern or something. I don't know. Let's see what the French do. Let's not get hasty here. Ah, oh, shit. 
Oh, now we do have access to Aragon. These access rules are so frustratingly random, it seems. So, it's kind of weird how that works. The reach out people want to get. <laughs> I see, Shrouds. Am I playing against real people? No, I'm playing against um, AIs. Now, would I be able to walk through that? No, I would not. To be able to enter Toulouse? No, I'd have to. Okay. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna siege up burn. The oh wow! He oh wow! He actually attacked me. That's okay. I didn't think he'd want to do that. But apparently he does. Uh, that's real dumb of him because this is hills. Then again, he does do a little bit more morale damage. We've got way more cannons though, and yeah, his line is about to break, so... Fun times! Hey, well, looks like the first battle is ours. I'm gonna need to keep all of my troops here, because if he marches all of his units over to my side, I can't beat him, unless I've got all my units together in one spot as well. Now, I need these fellows to go over there, and then do a little of that. Did Portugal join the war? No, they didn't. We need to fabricate claims on... Because I should not like, untie my shoes and play at the same time. Especially not at speed 4. That seems like a terrible idea. I really do want to get claims on these guys, though. Now, Portugal didn't join because Portugal freaking loves me. Now, what's my... Dynasty? Sorcy, eh? How old is my king? My king is 26. Oh man, if only we can get rid of this stupid heir, we'll be in a really good spot. She, he or she or whatever isn't even that bad. I don't know if it's a he or a she, because he is called Maria. But then again, it's his middle name or her middle name. No, it's the first name, because Lodovico. I don't freak. No, the, Lodovico is his first name. I honestly just don't know, so I... <laughs> Flory, it seems you have activated baguettes. Alas, they will stir a ruckus. <laughs> what other vassals does he have? I've got Croatia and uh, Catalonia, and of course the recently acquired Austria as my, uh, my uh, trusty bitches. Now, there is going to be a revolt soon. Volsinian heretics? don't know where they're uh, spawning from, although I can take a guess. Yeah. The overextension plus the war exhaustion is a bit of a pain on my, uh, on my economy right now. Oh, at least on my revolt risk end. Now, I am suffering a lot of attrition from sieging their province in Bern because I need to keep all of my units there because I don't know what the uh, thing he's gonna do. I could potentially leave half of them out of there. Oh, we just siege burn down, that's good. Uh, I think all we need to do now is siege up Labourd. And uh, let me just let me just uh, do a little something. Let's get all the normal infantry and the normal horses and the normal cannons and the weak units out of here. Put everyone in La board. Actually, let's get all the damage units out. And then get me two proper stacks. And they're gonna go say hi to Toulouse and that thing. Also, Armagnac. Kinda wanna siege that out. Other than that, I think we're pretty much good. Um, we don't have a lot of manpower, so look. Let me just do this again. Now let's check our army force limit. Yeah, we can build another nine uh, Merc units. Apparently the Mercs are really cheap in France, so I'm assuming they got admin ideas. Nope. 
did get economic though. I don't know why the mercs are so cheap in this country, but uh, I'll take it. If that's the case, then I can probably... I don't want to build them here. Well, it doesn't really matter, I suppose. I don't want to build a lot here, though. So I kind of want these sieges to finish so that I can build more there. And they should finish next month, or at least start finishing next month. Yeah, oh, wow, how did you finish in one hit? That is so weird. That is so weird. How do you finish in one hit? That is so weird, because they were at 70%. I pr they probably just... I probably just didn't pay attention. I'm going to go ahead and say that I probably just didn't pay attention. Now, this is going to hurt. This is going to hurt bad. Sucks, because you never know where he's going to come from. And you can't... Well, you can send scouts, I suppose, but you can't send them further than than the, the, the thing he allows, right? You can't send them further than the zone of control allows, so... You're still kind of botched when it comes to that. But, if we seize these provinces, we can certainly build a whole lot of mercs there. Oh, what? As if you've taken control- Oh, shit. Right, because I don't have any forts activated here. Oh, fuck. Uh, I thought I had my entire country covered. It is so not worth it to not cover your entire country. Because when there is a revolt, you'll forget about it, and it'll take forever for your uh, for your forts to get back into the position where they can actually do something. Luckily, Austria is being a trusty vassal person, though, and he's uh, doing the stuff he needs to do, like. Uh, making we win this battle and taking care of my revolt. Yeah, this battle's pretty much down. Yeah, I forgot that I needed to do that. It's really bad, but, you know. And I can't even enter Gascony until I siege uh, Labour down. Yeah, it's kind of bad news, Bears. Um... I don't have any manpower, so what I'm going to do here is I'm going to do this. And then check my uh, force limit again. That's one, two, three, four, f two, f three, four, five, uh, six. Okay. <sighs> At least it can't siege Roma down instantly because it's my capital. So there's a you get a free fort on your capital. At least a free fortification. You don't get an actual zone of control type for it, but you do get, uh, you do get like a, like a working fort. Floyd Roy, what's your end goal? Taking control of the Genua, Ven Ven Venice, and English Channel trade nodes. Unless I use ships, that means I'm gonna have to go through France. So. Okay, we finished scoring those, now we can probably finish this. Our war exhaustion is so insanely high. I mean, look at this. The only thing we've done was like siege two forts, and our war exhaustion's up to six. 
I don't care about the manpower, man. It's not about the money. It's about, like, I can use mercs. It's not a problem. This unit is locked, so I, I can't stop him. Hopefully these guys will stop fighting on that fort and start actually joining me. I don't think they will, though, but... No, they won't join, <clears throat> so we're just going to have to retreat somewhere. Thankfully, they are doing what they're supposed to be doing, though, so... Ah, welcome back, cool new chap. Yeah, maybe we can rip these to shreds before the French join, and we could. And we did. And we shall. Now, what's going on with this place? I really need to siege down number on. I really need to get back to Italy. And I don't think, unless I use ships, I don't think there is a way for me to do that. Oh, yes, yes, go, go join me, go save my ass. Thank you very much. Let's hope they don't go disloyal. We should definitely improve relations with them. Because I can see them going disloyal. I can see that happening. Oh, we've got 60 papacy points. Let's, uh... Oh. Yeah, I'd like that legitimacy to go up a bit. It's kind of disgusting the way, the way it is now. Now, let's go ahead and leave nine mercs in here. Leave four, five, six, seven, eight, and a cannon. And let's march our way down to Italy. Now, our army is in a really bad shape. We've got 12,000 units. But, uh, a lot of freaking regiments. I'm gonna take a loan here. Otherwise, it's gonna be disgusting. I can already tell, so. I don't have time to be cute with uh, building the mercs in France. So, we're just gonna be building them in uh, Italy itself. Merc city, bitch. Ah, an excellent min minister. Now, usually you would pick this option, right? For the admin points. But uh, we're lacking behind the military, and I need those. And, and I need those military points. I really do. Now, this next thingy tech is gonna give me this thing, which is really good. Admin Republic. It's so much better than the Kingdom. The Kingdom is really bad. But the Administrative Monarchy, now that is something I really want to get. I mean, the, the, we, right now we still got this feudal thing, which is just terrible. Why would anyone ever want that? That's just so bad. Alright. Once again, weak regiments out of here. You don't want to use those, they're bad. They fight, they fight bad. You do want to bring them along, because they do regenerate, so... And now I have to actually siege this. They won the siege instantly, even though they were on a fort, and now I have to unsiege it. Oh, I see. It's because, um, oh, well, that is so fucking stupid. They took the fort, so now I have to take the fort back. Because they, I mothballed the fort, they immediately, uh, mothballed, uh, unmothballed it. 
So you know France is making a comeback, because I'm forced to fight my rebels. That's so shit. That is so shit. I hate fighting rebels. I really do. With a passion. I don't know why that last battle was so incredibly destructive, but it certainly was. So. Oh boy. Not having the best of time today in terms of battles. But we can make up for that with uh, sheer merc numbers. And uh, some fancy, fancy war taxes. There you go. Seems Muscovy get, gets pooped on every time now. Yeah, well, it's because they lost their main strength, right? They can't kill people with attrition anymore, and we lost the broken of the siege. Okay. Now, I'm so tempted to just assault this right now, because this is freaking stupid. Uh, that does cost me military points. I think I'm just going to go ahead and assault. It takes too long otherwise. Well, it wouldn't be the first time, man. Uh, just, uh, just saying. I can't have these Castilian nationalists. Can they like just like disappear or something? Of course they can't. Cause, you know. I feel like Austria isn't doing anything in this war. I feel like I'm the only one doing anything and they're just like derping around. I don't know, man. This seems kind of dumb. I, I don't think I can walk to Toulouse. Oh, can I? Okay, they would then, uh, wait. No, why can't I walk into Armagnac? I seize these forts down. Alright, Castellus is being covered by Narbonne. Uh, I see. Oh, well, unless the other guys come, I don't think I can, uh, I can win that, sadly. Other armies got stack wiped? Okay. We could certainly piece Lorraine out, that's going to free up a lot of Austrians. You pay me war operations in your dockets, and annoy your troops with France while you're at it. It annoys me. Liege. Well, well that might be a possibility. can't believe he's going to unseach both of those. He shouldn't. He really shouldn't. He shouldn't be able to if my allies would uh, do something. But even Catalonia is just like sitting there. It's pretty funny. Oh come on, stop sitting. I just attach or something. Oh god. This is awful. I'm gonna pick up those idiots in uh, Savoy. This is ridiculous. This is actually ridiculous. I'm not gonna let them have those forts back. This is stupid. They better start doing something or else, I don't know. This is so dumb. They're just sitting there letting France take back his forts. It's stupid. I took five war exhaustion to take those fucking things. Are you gonna tell me that I can't keep them? No way. You guys better freaking help me out here. I don't care that I need to attack into a hill. You're gonna do something.
Okay, so we did do battle, or at least start battle. We've got way more guys, but uh, we did lose our discipline, dude. And we are attacking across the river. Because either that will let France take his forts back. And I'll be damned before I let France take his forts back. Let's take a 